Hello everybody. I just wanted to show you some stuff I've done with those um, rubber cookie cutters I got. So, but first of all, I want to show you leftover resin pieces. This is just a glow-in-the-dark little button thingy. And then this one, which is a star. Dollar Story glitter, it just turns like this. You can't tell it's glitter. But I think it makes a neat effect. I gotta, you know, dome that, so. That's just a star um, bead, see? You should see into it. But... And, okay. First of all, I'm going to show off the cookie cutters themselves. So, hang on. I'll show off the cookie cutters, and then show off the piece that made them. This is the star cookie cutter. You know, like I said, it's squishy. I put the tape on the back here, and set them on a piece of cardboard. And here is the star that I made. It's got glow-in-the-dark stuff. And then all those... Come on, focus... got stars and the moons in it. The back's sticky, I guess, because of the way the tape was sitting. It just made the it made it sticky. I'm gonna if you can if you can't tell it makes like a little lip. So I'm just gonna pour dome it in here. And then just seal the back. Because you know the back's kinda flat, so it worked out good. Um the next one is the heart, and like I said, you know, taped on the back and poured from the top here. Um, this is what this makes. It's decent size, and it's just holographic red glitter, pink polka dots. Um, these are really test pieces, so this one I'm actually going to turn into a magnet, probably. But it actually has real coffee grounds in it and brown glitter. If it'll show up, which it probably won't. But like I said, it's got real coffee grounds in it. Let's see, I'll do this. And some of them floated in front of the sticker, which is fine. And the sticker is just a, I think it's a latte. But I thought it was cute. And like I said, I'm going to turn it into a magnet after I dome it. But anyway, oh yeah, and that's the circle cookie cutter. Anyway, that's it. Um, later.